Right. I'm going to uh, show how to measure and position for a pelvic evaluation for hip dysplasia. First of all, I want to measure from the mid femoral region. And we're measuring 15 centimeters. I'll then refer to the technique chart where we'll have the MKB and MAS. And then I will plug in the, the exposure factors on the machine. And then I'll presume to position the dog. The dog is in dorsal recumbency. His thorax is, is within a radiolucent trough and we will make sure that he's symmetrical feeling for his ilial wings and we will then perform the extended view which will mean that we will have to frog leg him holding the task of the joints rotate his stifles so they're about one to two inches touching and then extend out making sure that they're parallel to the tabletop the beam will be centered distal to the ischium and we will collimate from the seventh lumbar to include the stifle joints and we'll co collimate left and right borders uh, to make sure we've got the femoral muscles in there. And then you can either hold the leg gloves or you can tape the distal femoral region to keep the stifles parallel and symmetrical. We'll place the marker in the field of view and we will then make sure also the tail is straight and we take the x-ray.